Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Lightning Cheat and today we are going to be celebrating the 20 year anniversary for Kingdom Hearts. Now, as you guys know, Kingdom Hearts is my favorite video game series since forever. Um, it was the first ever video game uh, that I ever played, but we'll get more into that later on in the video. So, right over here, the Square Enix official account. 20 years ago, today, the original Kingdom Hearts first launched in Japan. We started an unforgettable journey with Sora, Donald, Goofy. Whether you're a new Kingdom Hearts fan or have been with us from the very beginning. Something like me, I guess you could say. But uh, thank you for everything. And this is very beautiful to me because... You know, I, I love this series. I I honestly love this series. Um, It's just a great series to me because it helps me through a lot. But again, I'll go through that uh, afterwards. I just want to talk about uh, some things you may have noticed. Uh, there's no gameplay, there's no intro, I'll get to that in the next video, because uh, I plan to make a channel update and regards all of that. But uh, yeah, so this message out here is just great to hear. And also we see this from the official Final Fantasy uh, 7 Remake account, is that they're also celebrating the uh, anniversary with us, which is very surprising and pretty cool to see them do because you know Final Fantasy 7 Remake, Kingdom Hearts they're both arguably one of the biggest things Square Enix have produced in the recent years and yeah I'm really happy that uh, they made this <laughs> it looks great it's reminiscent of when uh, Sora actually did the same thing for the anniversary for Final Fantasy 7 Remake uh, earlier this year so that, that's a pretty cool thing to do, and I really like it. Uh, it looks like it's still Midgar though, I could be wrong, or uh, it doesn't matter. There's no point to analyzing this, this is an appreciation post. <laughs> but um, yeah, no, this is very beautiful. Now let's get on to what is Kingdom Hearts meant for to me. As you can see right here, I tweeted out Kingdom Hearts 20th anniversary, Kingdom Hearts have cha has changed my life. So much, it's unbelievable, from realizing the importance of friendship, to the boss rages, to the music, to the magic, everything in between. KH1 on the PS2 was my first ever game. I couldn't have picked a better starting point. So I want to actually reiterate on this and want to establish why Kingdom Hearts is a very important uh, series to me. Uh, during my younger years, I didn't really have... Um, I did have quite a bit of video games, but there weren't any video games that really piqued my interest. Then I saw this beautiful box art, and it was the Kingdom Hearts 1 box art. Uh, I saw Donald there, I saw Goofy there, and as a Disney fan, um, up till now even, um, it was pretty awesome to me to see, you know? Uh, so I picked the game up, uh, my mom bought it for me, and... I played it, and that opening just took me, it just blew me away, man. It, it really did. And after that, I didn't even know who the Sora kid was, right? So I was just playing this game, I didn't know who I was. I was playing to get to Donald and Goofy. Um, but then I started enjoying the story. I saw all of these uh, Final Fantasy characters. I didn't know they were Final Fantasy characters at the time. Because I started playing Final Fantasy because of Kingdom Hearts. Uh, because I saw Cloud Strife, right? And then I was like, oh, this guy's so cool. So I saw like the description in Germany's journal. And he said from Final Fantasy 7. And I was like, whoa, that's so cool. So I did. Uh, I tried to look at the store for a Final Fantasy game. Again, I didn't have internet at the time. I didn't have internet until 20. 17 2016 2016 2017 that's only when I got internet but this was when I was still like pretty small before the PS2 came out I was no no it was just no no not before the PS2 before the PS3 or maybe around that time because I was like six years old or something so yeah Sora uh, was a pretty cool character to play as I thought his jumping animation was weird like I was trying to jump like that in real life I don't know why <laughs> uh, but yeah because I was like, it can't be how normal people jump, can it? Uh, I tried it, it, it was stupid, <laughs> basically. Uh, but yeah, no, I kept trying to uh, play the game. I played the game, I enjoyed the game. I remember I got stuck at the 
Jaffa fight, I want to say. I was stuck at one fight. I forgot which one. But uh, it was pretty hard. And it was so hard for me to finish. I was stuck on that level for a few uh, weeks, maybe. Then I finished it. And I beat the game. I enjoyed it. Kingdom Hearts 2 apparently was a thing. But again, I didn't know about uh, Chain of Memories. So I got PS2. I was... I, not the PS2. The KH2. I was so excited. I was so hyped. I bought that. And I played it. I was enjoying it. The opening was so good. I saw Roxas. I was confused. <laughs> but uh, yeah. This was before I was like... Um, like full on like exploring the lore and all of that you know I was just I was enjoying the game I was really enjoying the game but now that I'm older I want to say that as a Kingdom Hearts fan it has changed my life a lot and for the better especially uh, one thing about me before I started YouTube uh, is that I was very shy I was very not outspoken I was a kid that kept to himself just did stuff, uh, I just basically did stuff that I had to and I left, uh, and I just left for home. But with Kingdom Hearts and YouTube, uh, I actually grew out of that shell, I grew as a person. Kingdom Hearts taught me how to make friends and, uh, you can ask basically anybody, I'm pretty easy and chill to talk to, I think. Um, I'm not somebody who will push people away, I think that's thanks to Kingdom Hearts. Uh, I really like it. It really taught me a lot to be very accepting, be very open, and of course be friendly to everybody. I feel Kingdom Hearts is a game that, uh, I know it sounds cliche, but I do feel that uh, not everybody should play it, but I feel it does deserve more attention. Uh, because it does help a lot of people, especially people who just want to forget about the world and forget about the normal world problems. I think Kingdom Hearts does a very good job with that, with the music, the magic, all I've said in that tweet. So my love for Kingdom Hearts goes to a very personal level because it has helped me through very hard times. It brought me to a world where I can forget about stuff and just remember that I'm a kid, you know? And... Thanks to this game, this game series, it helped me so much to make friends. I remember my first ever YouTube friend was uh, PlayStation. Uh, yeah, I, he was my first ever video. He was my first ever friend uh, on YouTube. Then it grew out to like uh, to Gumbo, to Mo Chocolate, to a lot of people basically. Uh, to Fabula Nova, of course. Just so many people that I'm very grateful for. To Nav, Nav, huge KH fan, beautiful man. Um, to Xavier, just... There's so much of people in the Kingdom Hearts community I also look up to. People like the Gamers Joint, uh, HMK, Soralam1, Limit Form, as well as Sarah Key. And just a lot of people like Bioroxus and everyone. You know, just, just all of these amazing people... Uh, made me love Kingdom Hearts way more when I did start getting internet, you know. And I also used to search them, uh, like when I used to go to like... My friend ha uh, took me to the gym a few times and we used to stay at the computers. So what I did was I uh, searched YouTube again. I didn't have any of this. <laughs> and then I saw like all these YouTubers. I was searching Kingdom Hearts stuff and then I saw these people and I was like, damn, they're really cool. Um, of course, I saw some people before others and all of that, so... Uh, yeah, I, I'm really happy for the community I'm in. I know I know that uh, sometimes we can be a lot, but... Um, this one video game has changed my life. It has... Been a... Big holding point, a pillar of the person I am. Uh, just like Sora, I try my best to find the light in every situation and like Donald I speak fast sometimes you guys don't understand me but you still uh, you guys still stick with me through it and as goofy I wish I was as smart as him but um, 
yeah, this series has really changed me. Uh, of course for the better. This game series, I love it, man. I really do. And yeah, that is... I know it's not a lot for the 20th anniversary, 20 years thin for the game. As you may have been expecting a video. Um, yeah, no, this is just my thoughts on the thin. I wanted to get this out as fast as I can. And again, I'll try and make a video explaining why there is some changes already to the video formatting and stuff in a future video. But for now, for today, we celebrate Kingdom Hearts. And yeah, I love you guys. I love this game. And yeah, guys. As always, it's Line H8. Blaze out.